Hi there, so today I thought I'd give a really quick tutorial just about the idea of taking something from a sketch to a final illustration just so that you, you can you can get an idea as a production artist how you can take someone else's sketch and then refine it so that, that it's a really nicely rendered out figure. Most of the time you will have stuff that's handed off to you so either it's a sketch like this that has you know the composition and everything created uh, because it's going to be placed in, in somewhere else in, in a module or in an animation so this is just an artist working out what the composition should be but what they haven't done is they haven't gone through and thought too much about like specific anatomical placements or the perspective or everything this is basically just a really rough tight sketch for composition and, and layout so I can show you where this is uh, going to live so you can see here how it's kind of being reused in multiple ways so the artist has gone through the storyboard and kind of worked out okay so this placement of the figure will be optimal for what we need okay so the idea is if you're giving a rough sketch like this you're expected to take it to the next level and to implement art fundamentals to make it look much better than what the original rough sketch is because that's this is basically what it is though it's just a rough sketch you have to maintain the idea of the composition though and you can't switch anything out which means that you can't swap things his arm can't be down all of a sudden you can't change the head positioning or anything like that so at least that gives you a framework to work towards you don't have to do the ideation anymore someone else has done that hard work for you your job now is to create this and implement good perspective good anatomy and good form but a lot of times, um, a lot of artists kind of struggle with moving away from the rough sketch, which means that you're, you're, if, you, if you try and base your figure too much and rely too heavily on this rough sketch, then you will get maybe illustrations or, or compositions that don't really quite work because you're basing it too much on the original rough sketch where the artist hasn't done the problem solving work of perspective of anything. So when you come to creating a rough sketch, your job here is to start thinking, okay, what does it look like now with proper perspective and form implemented? And you'll see the difference between the two, that there is some slight variations, but the composition is still the same. The positioning of the figure is still the same. Okay. So that that's basically where you need to take it to the next step. You, so we're not expecting you to completely rely so heavily on the rough sketch. Again, they've just done the composition, hard work, design aspect of it. Your job now is to implement the figure drawing, the perspective, and start refining and honing it there. Okay. If you rely too heavily on the original rough sketch, then your figure is going to look funky. It's not going to look correct. You're going to find there's going to be a lot of issues. And then when it comes to placing your anatomy in there, you're going to find it a lot harder because your, your foundations aren't correct. All right. So I, I hope that helps in terms of visualizing how far you, you, you can go with uh, being given a rough sketch and then where you can, um, where you can take it. Okay. Thanks.